local center is responding to the controversial comments made by Lieutenant Governor Mark Robinson about the LGBTQ community. And Onzo County, that community wants people to know they're not, quote, filth. Nine on your side, Cheyenne Pagan spoke with directors of the LGBTQ plus community center earlier. She joins us now from our Jacksonville studio. And Cheyenne, what can you tell us about that center's reaction to this controversy? Angie, Ken, the center's director says they believe Robinson is completely wrong for his comments. They say, however, they do agree that graphic depictions of sexual activities do not belong in schools. And not only are we not resigning, we are not going to stop until the schools in North Carolina are safe from this kind of filth. The lieutenant governor says he is trying to get, quote, pornography out of schools. He refers to the book in question, Gender Queer, as borderline child pornography. The center says it is important to talk about LGBT education in schools, but in a way to help overcome discrimination. Uh, I personally say, yeah, if there is some kind of graphic de depiction of sexual activity, it doesn't belong in a high school or an elementary school. In the aftermath of Robinson's comments, state lawmakers and LGBT advocates are calling for his resignation. The center shared the petition calling for his resignation. They say the reason why is because they believe Robinson is not interested in protecting the LGBT community. If the lieutenant governor isn't willing to, number one, completely apologize, and when I say apologize, I don't mean just speaking words. I mean actions. The center says it's harmful to use the kind of language that the lieutenant governor used, especially as an elected official. One of the first things I said to the members of our youth group that we run is that, listen, Lieutenant Governor Robinson may have been your first bully. Uh, please don't allow anyone else to be your second. October is LGBTQ History Month, and Monday it was National Coming Out Day. The center says it's extremely important to celebrate these things, especially now. Reporting from our Jacksonville studio, Cheyenne Pagan, 9 on your side. Cheyenne, thanks.